Last time when I got lost in the YouTube rabbit holes mindlessly browsing, I stumbled across these interesting visual stories that range from children's stories to inspirational stories. I realized that they were all created with AI. Some of them even had millions of views. It was fascinating. These channels can easily bring in over $10,000 a month with this many views. Seeing those videos got me thinking, could I create something similar or maybe something even better using the AI tools I know? So, I gave it a try. And I am happy to report, they are easily doable with the AI tools available to us nowadays. So today, I am going to show you my attempt to create an educational and entertaining children's story from start to finish using several AI tools at our disposal. And you can take the ride along with me. Ready? By the way, say hi to Ko. Ko will be watching with you like a hawk. What? Right, Ko? Silly boy. Most of these videos were likely created with ChatGPT and text-to-image tools like Midjourney or Leonardo AI. One problem, though, these are great tools, but they require a lot of prompt engineering to get the right images. Even with that, these tools generally still have a hard time creating consistent character images across all the scenes. This makes it particularly challenging to create character-based narrative stories like what we are trying to do here. So, it just takes a lot of work to get it right. Guess what? OpenAI has just recently incorporated DALI 3 with ChatGPT4. With that, ChatGPT4 will actually talk to DALI 3 to take care of the prompt engineering part for us. Now, we only need to worry about talking to ChatGPT in our own natural language. I believe this combination will make the entire creative process much smoother and more streamlined, cutting down the production time significantly. I want to give it a try to see if this will be the case. So, this is what I will do. Let's go. By the way, hit that like and subscribe button if you enjoy so far. Alright, first things first. We're going to need a story. Now, I could spend hours trying to write it myself, or I could enlist some AI help. Let's go with the latter, shall we? Enter ChatGPT, my go-to AI assistant for brainstorming. Watch this. I am going to ask ChatGPT to write a children's story about an old monk and a boy named Hero. In the story, the monk taught Hero the lesson of generosity. Because why not? Giving is good, right? By the way, pro tip. Give ChatGPT more details on what you are looking for. The more descriptive, the better. Like what kind of characters you want it to create, and what kind of style and tone you want it to write in. You could be pleasantly surprised by some of the answers it comes back. So, in addition to the story of the monk and a boy, I am going to ask ChatGPT to write it in a casual conversational style and use a light-hearted tone, and I will ask it to make sure to provide a good description of the scenes and the setting of the story. Let's see what we get. And there we have it. A story about a monk and a boy. Classic. All right, let's tweak this story a bit. Hey, ChatGPT, can we add a plot twist to make it more engaging? Perfect. Now, we have added a naughty kitty to the plot twist. What a story. We are not done yet. Next, we need to create a scene list. ChatGPT, could you create a scene list by breaking out the story into different scenes with detailed descriptions of each scene? Also, make sure to create a profile for each of the main characters like age, physical attributes, and unique personal features. We're going to need that for our next step. Here we go, just like that. We have a scene list and character profiles. With that, we are ready to create some images. Thanks, ChatGPT. Now off to Dali for some visual magic. But guess what? We are not going anywhere. Remember, Dali is part of the ChatGPT now, so instead of going off to another tool like Midjourney, we simply stay and chill here with ChatGPT. Dali is like a digital artist with a flair for the dramatic. Let's see what it can do for our old monk and the boy. Let's start with scene one. As I mentioned before, we talked to Dali through ChatGPT. Hey, ChatGPT. Can you ask Dali to create a visual image for our scene one based on our scene list and the character profile? You see? Because ChatGPT remembers the context of our conversation. It can relate what it understands to Dali without us worrying about coming up with the prompts. Pretty sick, right? Look at these. Not bad at all. It matches the scene description quite well. I am impressed. Let's bring these scenes to life. Next scene, please. Take a look at the actual prompt that ChatGPT uses. We can see that ChatGPT has added a lot of details to describe the image for Dali. 
We don't even need to lift a finger. Wow. Let's try another one. Hmm. Sometimes we need to remind ChatGPT to ensure image consistency from scene to scene. So, a little bit of back and forth is perfectly normal. Just like working with an assistant. That's more like it. Scene by scene, ChatGPT and DALI are turning words into stunning visuals. Each image brings us one step closer to our story. You're doing great, DALI, now that we have our script and scene images. Next up, we are going to need the voiceover to bring the story to life. For that, we are going to use Eleven Labs, arguably the best AI voice generator out there at the moment. And by the way, you can find the links for all the tools we use today in the video description below. Remember to check them out. Eleven Labs has hundreds of high-quality voices. Once we are over at the Eleven Labs website, our job is to find the best voice suited for our story narrator. We can easily sample all the voices in the voice library and then simply pick the one we like. So is cheerfulness, or a good temper. The more it is spent, the more remains. We have committed the golden rule to memory. Let us okay. now commit I think I like this one better. Let's settle. Now, we head to the speech synthesis page to turn our script into an awesome voiceover. It is quite easy. Once we pick the voice, we can make some adjustments to the voice settings. I typically will just use the default settings. We can then paste the script into the box and hit the generate button. Eleven Labs AI can learn from the context of our script and generate a voice with the appropriate tone and emotions. Pretty impressive, I must say. Once upon a time, and every time we press the generate button, village, it generates a slight variation of the script the if we so choose. There was an ancient temple. Don't worry. All the voiceover we have generated can be found in the history section. We can listen to them later and pick the ones we like to download for our use. Now that we know how it works, we just need to create a voiceover for each scene one by one. Off we go. Eleven Labs has a free tier and several paid tiers. Choose the one that fits your needs. If we use the free one, we need to make attribution to Eleven Labs in our video title and description. Now that we have the voiceover done, we can move on to put the final video together. For this step, we'll bring these elements together in CapCut. CapCut is easy to use and comes with lots of awesome features for video editing. It is my favorite video editing tool. It's like a digital jigsaw puzzle but more fun and creative. Best of all, it is free to use. We'll use the CapCut desktop version for this video. Once we are in CapCut, we bring all the scene images and voiceover files that we have created so far into the media section. It is a good practice to name the files by the scene number, just so we can easily line up the media files in the proper order on the video timeline. There we go. Everything lined up properly. Make sure to adjust the length of the image to match the voiceover for each scene. Next, we will add some cool transitions and video effects to make the video more animated and engaging. CapCut offers a lot of templates for special video effects. It is like picking candies from a candy store. Additionally, we can also use keyframe animation to manually bring the scenes to life. Everything is coming together nicely. Next, we need to add nice background music to add to the story's mood. YouTube Studio, here we come. YouTube Audio Library offers many royalty-free music tracks for creators. So, why not check it out? Let's see. Cinematic music with a dramatic mood? This track sets the perfect mood. We will use it. Now let's sync it up on our CapCut video timeline. There we are, nice and easy. Finally, let's put a finishing touch by adding the caption. CapCut can auto-generate the caption with one click of a button. This saves us so much time. Let's pick an animation template for the caption. Isn't it pretty? Now, add a title for the video and we are done. Just like that. Ko and I can't wait to show you the final result. I hope you're as excited as we are. Ready? Let's roll it. Once upon a time in a serene Japanese village, where cherry blossoms seemed to dance in the breeze, there was an ancient temple. This temple was home to a wise old monk named Kaito, whose knowledge was as vast as the years he had lived there. One bright morning, a young village boy named Hiro, known for his boundless curiosity and generous heart, ventured into the temple grounds. There, he found Kaito, who was sweeping the path clear of cherry blossoms. Good morning, Hiro greeted, 
his voice echoing slightly in the tranquil garden. Kaito looked up, his eyes twinkling with warmth. Good morning, young one. What adventure brings you here today? Hiro's eyes sparkled with excitement. Just exploring. Everything is so peaceful and beautiful here. Smiling, Kaito suggested a special task, revealing a chest filled with handcrafted toys destined for the village children. Hiro's eagerness to help shone brightly, and together they planned to distribute the toys anonymously at dusk. However, unbeknownst to them, Miko, the village storyteller's cat, had been watching with curious eyes. As they set about their secret mission, Miko followed, a silent shadow. And I think this is enough of a taste. What a story, right? The link to the complete video is in the description. Check it out if you are interested in finding out the ending. Remember, the world of AI is full of possibilities. Let's learn and grow together. If you are still watching, make sure to like and subscribe. Your support means the world to us and keeps content like this coming. From Ko and Kai, thanks for watching. Until next time, so long my friends.